We develop a multi-scale model for simulating liquid fabric interactions. Our model is effective in capturing varied liquid fabric interactions by considering scenarios involving mesh-based cloth, yarn-based fabric, and fuzzy cloth in contact with water. Building on modern mixture theory, we model liquid and fabric as continuous porous mixtures. In this model, we capture buoyancy, drag force, and microscale pore pressure. We also develop treatments for liquid capturing and dripping. To validate our method, we show comparisons focusing on individual components. Here we compare the simulation with and without buoyancy force applied to the cloth using fabrics with differing mass densities. With the correct pressure gradient applied to the fabrics, the left one rises, the middle one drifts, and the right one sinks. By contrast, if the pressure gradient is neglected, the fabrics sink and come to rest at the bottom regardless of their mass density. Here we compare a simulation with different parameters that vary with the reference. As we adjust the fiber diameter D, we hold the rest solid fraction phi zero constant by adjusting other parameters. The cloth with thicker and less yarns is more readily penetrated by liquid, and the liquid exhibits a longer working distance. On the other hand, as we adjust the fiber diameter, we hold the thread count N sub T constant. The cloth with thicker yarns but smaller pores is less easily penetrated by the liquid, resulting in less liquid retention inside the cloth. We also adjust the thread count while holding the fiber diameter constant. The cloth with more yarns but smaller pores is also less easily penetrated by the liquid and has less liquid retention. We also compare between different liquid parameters. Here we demonstrate the different behavior of acetaldehyde and olive oil, where the latter is much more viscous than water and the cloth is less easily penetrated with much shorter wicking distance. Finally, we demonstrate the effect where zero pore pressure is applied when the contact angle is 90 degrees. There is no wicking effect and the liquid is less attracted to the cloth. A classic experiment in the textile industries is a ring test. We compare our simulation with a physical experiment. When the liquid touches the cloth, wicking can be observed in both the physical experiment and our simulation. The nonlinearity of drag forces has a significant impact on the look of real liquid cloth interaction. The most obviously distinct visual phenomenon that can be seen in the nonlinear case is the formation of kinks around the region where the relative velocity between the cloth and the liquid is large. The same figure illustrates this kink effect in a real experiment in which large velocities are induced by pulling a cloth rapidly out of a liquid. We demonstrate wetting, dragging, dripping, and wicking effects of liquid cloth interaction in more examples, including mesh-based permeable and impermeable cloth, yarn-based fabrics, and fuzzy towels.
Thank you.